After weeks of increasingly heated exchanges, the posturing has become more physical. This is Iran's elite revolutionary guard in action. Its naval, air and ground units are conducting three days of war games codenamed the Great Prophet. During these exercises, a new ultra speedboat is set to be tested. The Iranians call the craft Yahmadi. It's a remote controlled boat and missile laden. Some 300 speedboats with the capability of firing rockets and missiles are also taking part in the exercises. Iran's Defense Minister General Ahmed Vahidi said new weapons would be test fired in the war games, but he did not elaborate. The military maneuvers aren't new. They've been taking place since 2006, but they usually take place in the summer. This year, the showing off of Iranian military might has been brought forward. Some analysts are interpreting this as Tehran's way of saying it's readying for a US or Israeli attack. Today, the first stage of the Great Prophet 5 war games was conducted with the blessed operation code of Yar Zainab. Different drills were conducted at the first stage. The war games have routinely heightened tension in the region, but recently they've taken on added significance as the standoff between the West and Tehran over Iran's nuclear program grows deeper. Iran has in the past signaled that it would close the Strait of Hormuz if attacked by the West. Some 40% of the world's oil and energy supplies pass through the narrow waterway at the mouth of the Gulf. The United States played down the significance of the maneuvers, saying that they didn't seem out of the ordinary from what Iran's military had done in the past. Ashish Joshi, Sky News, Dubai.